Every major event in world history, every major figure in world history appears to be encoded in the Bible. The Bible codes are a dramatic demonstration that what we have here really is the Word of God and not simply a, a historical tradition. These 66 books penned by 40 different guys over thousands of years are collectively a supernaturally given and skillfully engineered message system. Ordinarily, we would assume that this building, the U.S. Pentagon, and anything having to do with the Bible would be far removed from one another. But in 1994, Statistical Science, a respected mathematics journal, published Report Number 3, Volume 9, titled Equidistant Letter Sequences in the Book of Genesis. That report found its way to this door. This was the office of Harold Gann, senior cryptographer for the National Security Agency. But now he was absorbed in something else. You still working on that Bible thing? Your little 386 at home has been crunching numbers for almost two weeks now. 19 days, actually. 14 hours and 21 minutes. Gans knew that equidistant letter sequence was a code form widely used by various governments and their agents. The idea that they would occur in the book of Genesis was hard for him to believe. I don't know why you're wasting your time. And this thing's either pure coincidence or pure nonsense. I'm sure you're correct. He found it so difficult to believe that he wrote his own computer program based on his intimate knowledge of encryption techniques with the intent of disproving the results published by statistical science. What am I missing here? Probably the significance of what this means, if it's true. Oh, yeah, the, all the secrets of the world are encoded in the Torah, and only God could have put them there. This is Gantz. Oh, hi. Did the machine stop running yet? The computer had finally finished. His answer had finally come. What was that number again? But it was not the answer he was expecting. Uh... Well, as a matter of fact, it is true.